Okay, so this training video is going to walk us through how to do a simple absorbance measurement with the Blue Star Omega system that has a true spectrometer for capturing absorbance measurements. So the first thing we'll do is go up to the protocols button and click on that and go down to absorbance because that's the read that we'd like to do. You can see the protocol here, so we'll open up the colored protocol and I can change and choose the style of plate and format that I want to use. In this case, a Blue Star 96 plate. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to have the ability to scan at discrete wavelengths so I can enter in as many different wavelengths as I'd like for the wavelength scanning and enter in any values I want here for those wavelengths just like you're used to using. If you'd like to use the full spectra you can click on the spectra tab and enter in any wavelength from 220 to 850. So if I'm interested in um, a blue scan here I'm going to maybe set this at 400 and set the other one at maybe 600. And that'll allow me to scan that particular wavelength range and see every reading in there. The next thing we'll do is click on the Layout tab. We're going to go over here and choose the situation for the, the wells that I'd like. So if I click on the samples, I can choose a replicate. So I'll have two replicates here in lanes 8 and 9. And I just simply click and drag, and it creates replicates for each of those wells. If I have likes, I can put those in as well, and it's just as simple as doing that. If you have standards as well, you can put those in. When we're ready to run this plate, we just simply click on the green light, and we choose the protocol that we had run. We can enter in any of these notations that we'd like. Blue well titration, and click on start measurement. It's going to go out and start measuring the... Uh, the wells that we're interested in and bring up a current state display. In the current state display, you'll see it displays the true wavelength of from 400 to 600 for each of those wells. You can see the blanks being measured here on the other side. So this dynamic measurement allows you to confirm that the experiment is running as appropriately and give you some feedback immediately without having to go into the analysis software. You can double click on any one of these wells and see where everything is. You can click with this mouse and put it at the peak of the blue here and see that 445 is the peak wavelength for absorbance for this particular well. We're going to close that current state window and now we've got our run saved. We can go into the analysis software later on if we want